U.S. Transportation Secretary Pete Buttigieg was in central South Dakota today taking a look at an airport that is getting an upgrade. Governor Lance Dan Santella spoke with him and others in Chamberlain. Transportation Secretary Pete Buttigieg spoke highly of operations at the Chamberlain Municipal Airport after taking a look at the facility this afternoon. They've been able to operate a, a very important general aviation terminal that, that's not just important for something like pheasant hunting season, but for something like uh, medevac operations that happen about 200 times a year, so more than every other day. That's a critically important mission for this community. And with not a lot of resources, the folks here have made it work. More than $800,000 of federal grant money will pay for a new terminal here. The city of Chamberlain has applied for additional federal money to extend the airport's runway. The airport usually has two or three flights every day, but that number expands to 10 or 20 a day in hunting season. We are expanding the runway to bring in the bigger planes for medevacs, and, and we get a lot of jets in for hunting season as well. So that's kind of the plan there, and right now our current um, terminal is about a 500 square foot building that is very old. Pilot Sean McMahon, who has helped the city run the airport, was also on hand today. You're not seeing the commercial planes, but you know, tourism, recreation, and business to get businesses to come to cities like Chamberlain, you need to have this, this transportation network. Because even though uh, a six-figure grant like the $800,000 we're putting into this might be considered a, a rounding error in, uh, in New York City, uh, that's make or break where I come from, and I know uh, the same is true in a place like this. Buttigieg is here, he says, to drive home the point about what funding can do. I'm trying to send the message that uh, you don't have to, uh, a project doesn't have to be in the billions uh, and a, a population doesn't have to be in the millions in order to matter. In Chamberlain, Dan Centella, Kelloland News. Buttigieg is uh, scheduled to be in Salem tomorrow where trucking will be the focus.